Hi, I'm Erica. I'm 12 years old, and someday I would like to walk again. Hi, my name is Cheyenne. I am 10 years old, and I would like to hit a home run again. I'm Dylan. I'm 11, and I'm going to play down tomorrow again. Hey, I'm Rhett Wheeler. I'm a physical therapist at Children's Hospital. Though I'm a bit older than these kids, I do share their desire to see them fulfill their dreams of being able to walk again, throw a baseball, and play dodgeball again. See, these kids are, are either weakened or partially or fully paralyzed by some sort of neurologic injury due to a spinal cord injury, stroke, a traumatic brain injury, or other neurologic insult. Through recent advances in medical technology, a highly beneficial intervention called FES cycling has been developed. FES stands for Functional Electrical Stimulation and involves the use of electrical stimulation and a specially adapted stationary bike. Here's how it works. The electrodes are attached directly to the skin in order to activate underlying muscle groups to induce movement. The electrodes can be used on one or both legs or arms depending on the child's needs and on multiple muscle groups at any given time. We can increase or decrease stimulation as necessary through a computer device attached to the cycle. We can also log important information about the child's condition and monitor a child's progress. Our goal is to get children to where they have more control and more strength in their various muscle groups so that they become more functional, so that they can stand, walk, or move in a more functional and efficient way. Among the many benefits of FES cycling are increased muscle strength, increased aerobic function and endurance, weight loss, increased blood circulation, increased range of motion, increased bone density, and decreased risk for complications associated with paralysis and or immobility. So a vote of support for us is a vote for our children and their future.